Give me everything I got you. Give me everything. Give me everything I got you. Give me everything I got you. That's my shit. Give me everything I got you, bro. 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 We ain't going nowhere. We ain't going nowhere. We ain't going nowhere. This is my brother Chris. He paid rent back. Let me go. No, ain't no 802 shit. Like I said, get the fuck out with you. Get my shit. Get my shit. What shit? You got some motherfucking shoes? Now get the fuck out. How the fuck y'all managed to get into my shit, boy? How y'all get into my shit? What about that? What? What is it? What is it? This is why she ain't want me to come over here. I should scrape her ass. Fuck that hoe. You fuck about shit. Goof ass bitch. Ain't my bitch. shit, bro. That bitch a hoe. She a hoe. She a hoe. She a hoe. Somebody she a hoe. I ain't breaking your shit. How the fuck you get it? You ain't got no key? I do got a key. Stay right there. I know. I ain't going nowhere. Here we go. Check this out, fellas. It's an ongoing problem in these relationships. Not all relationships, but it's adding up now. You know what I'm saying? If they want pipe, there's nothing you can do. There's nothing you can do. They're going to do what they're going to do. They're going to get to it how they're going to get to it, man. And they're not going to give a fuck about it. And they will do it up under your dime. Do they do that to all men? Of course not. But we're going to get to it, though. You already know this KC, the Red Pill Alpha. Look at y'all again with that heat, keeping it cracking, keeping the shit jumping. Wrist, elbows, knees, feet, shin, and everything to the back of her neck, holding down, locking it down, submerging down the game. Please like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. As soon as I'm done with these videos, piping high status, you're going to get it down your phone until you hear all your candy game. Oh, yeah, you're going to get it. Go at me in the description box below, and you'll know how to get at me. My videos for education purposes only, very useful. And let's keep these subscribers going. A thousand the better is the goal. Let's get there. Let's do that. As you see in the video, the subscriber sent me, good looking out, you know. I had to do a little editing on it. I don't want to put it all the way out there like that, you know, get a, you know, get my fl channel flagged. You know, get my channel flag because there's a lot of profanity and I know motherfuckers cursing. It ain't no fighting in it or whatnot, but you get the picture due to policies. But you can do whatever you want to do, fellas. You can support her lifestyle. You can provide her with the riches, the, the gifts. You can keep that belly full, you know, keep them clothes on her back. You know, she got children. Maybe the stepfather in that situation. You stepping up. You being a man. You know, you feeling, I got to do what I got to do for this woman because I love her. I care for her. You know, she's a part of me. And then some of you fellas, some of you fellas think to yourself, you know, hey, she's all I got. I don't want to get out here and meet no one new. I don't want to get out here and put myself out here to um, be that man that's single. Some guys be thinking to themselves, I don't want to be that single man in the club. I don't want to be the single man just laying at home and living alone. You know, I be getting too old for that. I don't want to be that person. I got to lock down. I got to find someone that's for me. And you guys will get out there and you will actually find a woman. And you feel that's for you. Instead of letting the shit come to you. Instead of letting her come to you. You know what I'm saying? She found you. You know, she want to get down with you. She want to be a part of you. But you feel like you got to go find that person. Time's ticking. I'm getting older. <sighs> All this shit plays in your mind. You take her in. You somewhat try to build with her. You know, you want to have that family structure. 
providing for. You're doing everything you can to make sure your baby, your boo thing, is happy. You dig? Your wifey has it all. She don't have to look to no one for nothing. That's how you come off. Then to come and find out that she's fucking in your bed. She's going the next motherfucker in your bed. She's topping him off in your bed. She's analing it out. Everything under the sun. Feet fucking fetishes. Whatever you can think of. In your bed. Why you at work? You can't put your hand on it. You can't touch it. You don't know what's going on. You can't put your finger on it. You don't know what's happening. You just know that these things is transpiring. So just like doing the video, you send somebody over there to stalk her. Your sister, your mother, your father, your brother. In some cases, you may be you know, some guys that had their children doing this shit. If they children are old enough, you know, help them or help my father out. You know, she can't be, you know, my father can't be getting played by this hoe. You know, shit like that transpired. <laughs> you seen the love after lock up shit. You know, I, I definitely like that show. Motherfucking simps all on that shit. Yeah, shit goes down like that. You seen cheaters? This shit happens. You also seen First 48. It really happens. <laughs> right? Yeah. This what goes down. You do everything for her and come and find out she never gave a fuck about you. She fucking a motherfucker that can't even do what you do. She fucking a motherfucker that wouldn't even dare do what you do. Wouldn't even want to take your spot. <laughs> laughing at you behind your motherfucking back while you at work slaving busting your ass bunions and corns and all that shit building up on your feet you making ends meet you come home cook meals she rubbing my feet same old boring ass routine but in her mind this ain't what it's gonna be I'm gonna have me a little fun a lot of you guys be allowing your woman to stay home. If you in a relationship, you married, it's your baby mama, y'all allow them to stay home. You allow them to, you give them enough wiggle room to wiggle around your ass. And that's what they do. You know, instead of having a bitch be a part of your program or whatever you got going on. You know, she's being intuitive. She's being attentive to you. But you don't see it that way. You feel like this will keep her in her place if I allow her to not work. Baby can't work. I'm getting this money, man. My, my baby can't do this. My baby can't do that. You know, I'm working over shit. Why would she do? Who's she going to find like me? Shit. You motherfuckers don't even know. She ain't got to find nobody like you. It's always the motherfucker opposite of you blowing her motherfucking back out, her throat out. He's giving it to her. Silent, but deadly. Real talk. You don't know this. You know, you figure you doing everything you do that's keeping her in her place. She's happy with you. She's happy with that. You must don't know a woman. Women are not really happy with the shit you can do for them. They're only happy what they can do for themselves. And what she can do for herself is what you can't do for me. And that's her time to time want to see other men because she's seeing them it's a social media era they in her face they whispering you know sweet nothings and they, they giving her that ear candy game they in her DMs some of them she ignores some of them she okay looking like some some of them she's excited to have there so levels just know that she got the pick of the litter just like you got the pick of the litter. It's the same thing. It ain't no different. You can act on it just as well, but you choose not to. Try to keep everything 100 with baby. But baby don't give a fuck about what you think. She don't give a fuck about what you got going on. She care about what she got going on, what's going through her mind, and what's benefiting her. She got you here paying for everything, and she got this motherfucker here looking good and handsome to her in her eyes. He can just serve me the dick. That's it. And I can give you some here and there when I feel like it. When when he ain't giving me the dick. Basically. Real shit. 
Fellas, are relationships overrated? I'm not going to say that. I ain't going to be the one to say that because there are women out here that like you for you or will fuck with you for you. You know, there are women out here that you, you know, you that she can come in and help push you to a whole nother level of where you're trying to go and be a part of that shit and sustain that stabilized place with you. She could, she could be there. There's women like that. And I'm not discrediting them. They're there. But at the same time, in this era, a lot of these women just want their cake and eat it too. She's having her cake with old boy. She got it. It's there. He's arguing. He's sending people to stalk her. He's tripping out and all that shit. And he want answers. He's going to want answers. You don't think he's going to call her later? You goddamn right he's going to call her later because he put his all on tour. He probably ain't got no other options. He probably ain't got no other bitches. So he, he got nothing to really fall back on. You know, he probably put his all on tour. He... When you put your all into a motherfucker, then it's going to be hard for you to, you know, wiggle around that, you know, because that's what you're used to. You built that. Mentally, you built that. You did that to yourself. So it's hard to get up out of it. You can get up out of it. It's going to take some work. Just like it took you a hard, you know, some work to put right into it. You know what I'm saying? It took you some work to drop everything you had just to focus on this. You know, real, you know, real shit, man. You know, it was hard to let these chicks go, let the street life go, let the clubs and the homies, all that go. It was hard to do that, but you had to do it for this. And you did it for this, come to find out this shit wasn't even for you. Now what? And it's all under your roof. And it's all under your roof. And she don't want to get out the motherfucker. She ain't trying to go nowhere, even though she did what she did. She ain't trying to go nowhere. She ain't trying to leave. She got caught and she still ain't trying to leave. You, you see a little bit in the video, she ain't trying to leave. And I've seen the rest of the video, she, she ain't trying to leave, put it like that. Nah, you know, it's not happening. She ain't not eventually leaving, you know, but she ain't trying to leave. Nah. You know, she feel like, shit, this, this shit was luxury. This shit was everything I had. He's taking care of everything, and I get the fuck when I want to, but I got caught. So now, you know, came to an end. You know, everything come to an end, you know, but. It's just the time. That's what it is. Watch yourself, fellas. Protect yourself, man. Don't be out here giving y'all like that, man. No. Let that bitch give her all. She got to give her all in order for you to turn around and reward that favor. You know, you know, reward that towards her favor just because she's giving her all to you. And you see that she sees that she's ready and she's willing and she's on that page. Then you can be okay, cool. She got to show you, so show and tell. Bitch, show me this shit. Let me know what's going on. Show and prove. You know, shit, fuck that shit. Don't be telling me shit. Show me what's going on and prove to me that you're down. Are you out this motherfucker? You got to go. Because you holding up spots for the next woman that's willing to do it. Real talk. Or the women that's willing to do it. <laughs> like these videos, share them, and subscribe. But fellas, have that dignity about yourself, man. Don't go out like this. Not at all. It ain't even worth it, bro. It's not even worth it. Mm -mm. Don't allow too many motherfuckers around your space. Being too kind and being too nice and being too friendly. Entity. Check that game. Holla.